Hello everyone, my name is Father Law, and today I've brought out my Rep 67 Lawbringer, and I'm just going to be playing some duels. This is my first duel of the day, <clears throat> and we have this other Lawbringer here that we're going to be fighting. I'm just going to play a few duels today, and uh, hopefully I'm playing well today. Usually you can tell how well you're going to play off your first kind of match. Some days I'm just kind of sluggish. Those are the days I just try to rep up. Oh, he got me on that. I not that time though. Nice. Well, I got the zone, but he got the light. And he's out of stamina now. I probably could have fainted to guard break there because of the wall. <laughs> oh, that was close. That was really good. <laughs> the out of stamina top light can be dangerous, I guess. It looked like he tried to parry it there at the end and he missed. That's got to be annoying. I really didn't think he'd do that. Nice. He thought I was going to shove there. Tries to back dodge that. A little late. Nope. Kind of low on stamina. Nice, you got me on that. Really need to get my stamina back. Oh, that was good. Barely missed that. Caught him dodging. The unblockable will catch them from the side if they try to dodge the shove after your second heavy. And you see that my second heavy actually hit him. He dodged into it because he was trying to dodge the shove both times there. But I hit his guard the first time and then the second time it was unblockable so it just went right through. So this guy can't react to the shove mix up which is why those are landing. That was nice. Aww. Nope. Ooh. Almost. <clears throat> he just kind of got mixed up there on this. That's not bad, though. It's a good start, so we'll see if we can keep this up in uh, another duel. Alright, so I found a raider. I believe they're like rep 30-something with him. <sighs> so that should be good. Good practice. Nice. I knew he was going to try to guard break me there. Almost paired that. I did pair that. Oh, wow. What the... I don't know why guard broke. Did he try to parry me while he was out of stamina? Because it looks like that's what he might have been trying to do. Or he was trying to hit me as I was coming towards him. I don't really know. That was just kind of weird. Sometimes people get really weird whenever you parry their lights. If that's what they can get away with, then... They don't really know what to do whenever. Barely missed that again. I'm still getting used to the uh, <coughs> stunning tap. Nice, hit him right out of that. Thought I was going to throw a light. Hit him with the heavy. Ah. Uh, not this time. Get that stun, the follow up light, into the unblockable. Now, right there. I just want to point out, my stamina was really low, so normally if you get a grab while they're out of stamina, you throw them, you do a side heavy and a top heavy for 65 damage, I didn't have the stamina for that, so I delayed it, did a top heavy for the stun, and I delayed it enough to where I got enough stamina to follow the stun up with a light, which is much harder to react to after the stun, so, stamina management, especially with Lawbring, is really key whenever you're playing him, I can't stress that enough, and right there I was just... I was super close to shoving there. He almost didn't get that. Okay. 
I think he was trying to back dodge her. And he barely missed a pair on that. Oof. Like, how much damage that did. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about with these parries, man. They do so much damage. I'm gonna try to keep this up. Round one. <laughs> so, uh, I found a Hitakiri. <sighs> See what they got. Wow, I thought I dodged that. That was good. Did a good parry. Oh, another one? Wow. It's kind of ballsy. I I really had a feeling that he would faint to guard break that, which is why I threw the heavy. So early. <clears throat> I saw a lot of you guys uh, were telling me in my uh, last video about your matchups with Hitakiri with your mains. I found that really interesting that uh, Bash based heroes really shut her down, and then heroes like uh, Assassins, especially Zerk, you guys said that you have a, a tougher time trading with her because she has pretty high health and near instant hyper armor on neutral heavies. So. Which is pretty much what I expected to be said. Uh, that is pretty annoying, especially for assassins, I would imagine. Just pretty much have to kind of turtle against them. Oh, I saw that coming. I don't know. I just. Alright, he got me. That was good. I really did not play well that round at all. Like, right off the bat, I took all that damage, and then it was just an uphill battle from there. You you really want to avoid doing what I did that round and taking a ton of damage right off the bat. <clears throat> but if you do, don't don't um, feel defeated, because you never know, you could turn it around. And he's really, he really likes to throw the zone. Nice. I didn't want to go out of stamina there, so I didn't throw the ball of light. I will go out of stamina here, mainly because the amount of damage I was able to do. Yeah. I had a feeling he'd throw a light. Because he wanted to get that damage in quickly, so he threw the light to go into his mix up, but I parried it. So. Yeah, you'll get a feel uh, for when people want to make up damage quickly and you'll learn what they want to do then. I'll take this trade. I saw that trade coming a mile away, but I'll take two heavies over his. I honestly thought that was a heavy, which is why I impaled him. <coughs> Did I get dodge? Nah, I would have let that hit me. I had way too much health. It's not worth taking ass damage punish there. I would have let it hit me. Even if you did that, fine. Alright, not bad. I'm gonna do one more duel. Round one. Alright, so I uh, fought this raider earlier in the. You'll see in the video. Uh, I just happened to run into him again, so we're just, that was a good parry right off the bat for him. Nice. <clears throat> so this round is looking pretty good. I knew he'd throw that heavy because I just parried the light. He's trying to mix me up. It didn't work. Yep. Everything he did that for. Alright, so that was good on him. Every time a raider hits you with a stunning tap, if you're playing Lawbringer, I would suggest not attacking immediately like I was just doing there as you will be incredibly low on stamina. So a uh, good tip for any of you guys out there struggling with Raider. Um, your stamina management is key in this fight, especially. Um, so after the stunning tap, just watch what you're doing. Don't let him get the guard break. Don't let him get you out of stamina. That was a good parry. Yeah, that did so much damage. 
Oh, I don't know what he's doing there. Maybe he's trying to parry a light or something. Or maybe he's just trying to attack me. I don't know. Victory. I just realized all my duels have been on this map. I don't know why I keep finding it. It's a really beautiful map, though. I really, I actually really do like this map a lot. I wish uh, it was playable in Dominion or something, because you never really see it in Tribute. Never really get to play Tribute. <laughs> Barely missed that light. Nice. Oh, that's... This is beautiful right here. Everything that just happened. Oh. That round was perfect. <laughs> Uh, that's a great way to end the video, actually. That round was actually smooth. Alright, well, thank you guys for watching.